All right, it's Wednesday, so it's time for another Workout Wednesday. Now, I'm training for the 100 meters, but I don't know how to do that. I've never actually trained for the 100, and I'm in desperate need of a coach. So on Friday, I'm actually gonna go and ask a, a mentor of mine if he'll coach me for the 100. But in the meantime, I need to establish a baseline. Uh, I know I'm out of shape, but I don't know how out of shape I am. So we're here in beautiful Eugene, Oregon, at South Eugene High School, and I've probably run I don't know, a million laps around this track. Um, and I love working out here, especially because the Amazon Trail is just a couple hundred meters away. And so today, I'm gonna run three by 200, easy, medium, hard, and then I'm gonna run an all out 800. And that's gonna tell me where I'm at. I have run so many 800 repeats and so many 800 races, so an all out 800 is gonna give me a really good estimate about where my fitness is at. It, it's not gonna be under two, I'm hoping it's under 2.30, but there's only one way to find out. First, I need to do a world-class warm-up, and you guys saw last Wednesday, my world-class warm-up takes about 45 minutes. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it right here. Let's get started. <laughs> All right, I'm all warmed up and ready to run. Um, check out this trail behind me, how great is this? So the beautiful thing about this is I can run the 200s here on the straightaway coming in. Um, like I said, I'm gonna run the first one easy, the second one medium, and the third one hard. Uh, the trail's in pretty good shape today, so it should be pretty quick. Let's actually get out there and see what kind of shape it's in. That was 36.7. Lungs are kind of burning, it's cold out here. Um, that's good, I, I'm almost thinking of these 200s as an extended warm up. So I'm not putting a lot of pressure on myself. I just want, want to turn the legs over, get the lungs going, get myself as warm as possible before I start that 800. So that was easy, 36.7. Let's see what medium gives us. More of a medium paced effort, 34.6. So I'm dropping about two seconds each interval, which is about what I would expect as I change my intensity level. That means this last one, which is my hard effort, needs to be 32. I am a sub four minute miler. I once put eight of these back to back sub 30s, but it's a lot different when you're 35. It's a lot different when you're out of shape, and it's a lot different on the bark dust. I mean, this is considerably slower than the track. So I can't beat myself up, I just have to keep taking it one interval at a time. This next one is my hard effort, 200 meters. I'm shooting for 32 seconds. but I had to really dig to do it. I don't have the turnover like I used to. I don't have the snap. Feels like my tendons and ligaments and muscles are just fighting it. I need to get back in shape. I feel good, I feel really warm. And now what I need to do is run an all out 800 and really see where my aerobic capacity is. I have no idea if that's helpful for 100 meter training or not, but I'm curious as a guy who was in pretty darn good shape for about 20 years there. I'm curious where I'm at. In my, in my peak, when I was really fit, on a, on a good day like today, with the trail in good conditions, I probably could have run 150 to 155 all out on this trail in trainers. My goal today is to break 230. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. I just want to run a 230 800, 229.9 is the time to beat. Here we go. All right, this is the spot. We're exactly 800 meters <clears throat> from the finish line. And uh, I fairly well recovered. I walked back, my heart rate's down, but I'm nervous, so <laughs> it's elevated. Um, I just don't wanna, I know I'm out of shape, so I'm not gonna beat myself up over this, but I just, I wanna break 230 just to know that I, I can still be in that kind of shape. So 
I'm gonna put the tripod down, film my start, and then uh, see you guys at the finish line. I'm taking a running start though. <laughs> Uh, nice actually, job. I feel good about that. Now I have no idea how that's gonna help me in the hundred. What it does tell me is I'm kind of out of shape, though, and I need a coach. Next video coming up, I go find a world-class sprint coach to help me reach my goal of breaking 11 seconds. Thank you guys for joining me for this workout Wednesday video. Lots more where that came from. A new workout video every Wednesday. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. See you guys soon, I'm 225 baby, woo!